So he's healthy. And that feels like a miracle. And uh, he's already the size of a cabbage, uh, which means that I am further along than I thought. So um, the baby might be Owen's, not Link's. Might be or is? Might be. Um, I don't know. And there wasn't a ton of time between the breakup and the hookup. Link and I are really good together. Um, like, almost painfully good. You know, it felt like that thing that we'd both earned in this life it was accidental and it was perfect and... And now it's not. Because he wants to know the baby's biology? Because he's um, not sure that he wants to be with me if the baby isn't his. And that makes me not so sure that I want to be with him if the baby is his. You and Owen have a complicated relationship. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, that's what he said. <laughs> but I want him to love me enough that that doesn't matter. I love you. More than my biological sisters. Biology doesn't matter. Love matters. Okay. And still, if I were Link, I would be terrified. I'd be terrified that the baby is Owen's. And that if it is, that connection might reignite whatever embers still exist between you and Owen. If I were Link, I would want to know, too. And it wouldn't have anything to do with how much I love you. OK, but can you stop pretending that you're Link? Can you pretend that you're me for a minute? OK. OK, OK, OK. OK, if I'm you, Imagine that the hormones coursing through my body would be overwhelming. <laughs> they might overwhelm rationality, and I just might want to be held. And um, loved no matter what. And reassured that I'm not going to be alone. <laughs> I love you. I got you. I got you. You're not going to be alone. <laughs> <sighs>